Anaphylaxis is a life-threatening situation. The first thing you have to do is identify whether a person is having anaphylaxis. It can be caused by bee stings, it can be caused by allergy shots, it can be caused by food ingestion. Anaphylaxis is where somebody flushes, they get red, they break out in hives, the throat swells, the eye swells, they can lose consciousness, you can begin to wheeze. The treatment of choice is once it's recognized as quickly as possible without waiting a half of a second is to use an EpiPen Autoject. Let me show you how to use an EpiPen Autoject. A person should carry this with them or a school should have it on the playground. If I lay this on the table or lay it flat, I'm gonna grab it with my strong hand. I'm right-handed, so I'm gonna grab it, hold it like a dagger, not like a plunger. Holding it like a dagger, you take off the blue hat. That's the safety to the gun. Once that's removed, this will work. Prior to this, nothing will work. We take off the blue hat. Now it's ready to work. We're going to jab this in the muscle part of the thigh. So we're going to hit and hold two, four, six, eight, ten, and slowly take it right away. That will inject 0.3 cc's of 1 to 1,000 aqueous epinephrine. It's the treatment of choice in anaphylaxis. Let me review one more time how to use the EpiPen. I'm going to reload it. This is a trainer, so it really doesn't have any medicine in it. You hold it like a dagger. You take off the blue hat. You hold it and you hit it into the muscle of the thigh. Let's pretend this is now let's don't even do that. I'm going to lift up my thigh. I'm going to hit. I have to jab hard and hold. So we hit and hold. Bang. Two, four, six, eight, ten. That's counting to ten by twos. That's plenty of time. And then when you pull it out, this covers the needle. So the needle can't stick somebody else. That's the way you use an EpiPen. It's the treatment of choice. When you make a decision to use the EpiPen, you should call 911. That person should end up going to the emergency room. You can give Benadryl after you use the EpiPen, but don't, don't wait. Be sure you use it quickly and don't be afraid of it. You could save somebody's life.